Hey everyone, it's Jaden from Mission Bit. Welcome back to part two of our Unity and GitHub series. In this video, we're gonna learn how to invite collaborators to work on our project together and learn how to pull and push changes. So let's jump right into it. To start off, I'm on the repo we created last video. If you haven't seen that one yet, you should go watch it right now. First thing I wanna to do to invite a collaborator is head into settings. I'm gonna choose the first tab, collaborators. And in this case, I'm just going to add another account that I have so I can have access to it on my GitHub desktop. And that should be good for now. Your collaborator is going to receive an email for the invitation you sent, and they'll need to accept it in order to set this up. Once they accept it, you'll be linked to this page, and what you want to do is just accept the invitation. There we go. Now all your collaborator needs to do is clone the repository like we did in the previous video. Grab the link and clone it into their GitHub desktop. So I have my project downloaded and opened up now on my collaborator account. From here, I'll just make a few changes and push it to our main repo. We'll save our changes and close the Unity editor because it's really good practice to close it when you're pushing changes because things are not going to save properly and you'll probably cause crashes on a pretty important stage of your process. We'll commit and push our changes here and check our GitHub website to see if things were updated. Commit and push. All right, so you can see that it was updated by my collaborator account just now. I'm going to log out of my collaborator account and back into my original author account. Now, what does it look like to download changes made to our device? I'm going to simulate some changes by just updating the readme right here. Just a small little change. Commit and commit to main. Now I have just a mini update on my repo. It was updated just now. So on my collaborator account, I could fetch origin, which is basically going to update and check if there's any changes. So after we do that, we notice that there's a pull request right here. So we'll just do that. And now that you did that, all changes should be made on your device. Cool. All right. That just about sums it up. Today, we learned how to invite a collaborator and the basic workflow of pushing updates and pulling changes made. Let us know in the comments if you want a video about GitHub branching and how to use that to keep your project organized. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.